Hi there, my name is Jezebel Tourmaline here and I am bringing you an oracle message for the sign of Taurus. Taurus. Oh my goodness. Okay. We have the thinking woman in the upright, card number 47. Sorry, Taurus, just making sure we don't have any more flying cards. Especially ones that are going to fly right into the garbage next to me. We don't want that. Okay. Can I get two more cards, Holy Spirit, for the sign of Taurus, please? Some general guidance and direction. What's you, Periwinkle? My new veggie. It's brightly colored. Okay. We have door to spirit, but in reverse. Card number 32. And one more card for the sign of Taurus. Taurus, 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 Taurus. You can do it, Paralinkle. Oh, remember the song. You can make it like a game. Card number 43, man holding a coin in the upright. So... Uh, we have the thinking woman in the upright, card number 47. So this could be you, or this could be someone in your energy. You have, you are a woman that is care carefully considering a situation or a scenario, or you have a woman that is in heavy contemplation over you now, Taurus. We have door to spirit in the reverse. This card is telling you to reconnect with the spiritual side of life and to reconnect with your higher power and to commit more to spirituality because in reverse uh, signals uh, a lack of spirituality in your life. Perhaps the decisions that you're making are blocking you off from God, source energy, your higher power. And we have man holding a coin, card number 43 in the upright. This could be you, Taurus, or this could be someone in your energy, perhaps a male of wealth and influence that is coming into your life to bless you. So card number 47 in the upright is the thinking woman, female of wisdom or understanding. This card shows a woman holding a book, standing before a staircase, ready to lead you to higher understanding, Taurus. Hmm. Orange. Must be our second and this woman could be a friend who helps you experience or express and understand your feelings. Or she could be a teacher brought to your life at this time to take you to a new direction. This could also be a new love interest with a woman who is thoughtful, conscious, and aware. Or, like the thinking man, the card could represent a side of yourself that's ready to blossom and bring clarity and assistance to the world. If so, find your voice and let your wisdom shine. And the affirmation for this card is, I am open. I open my mind and my heart to my own inner wisdom. I am thoughtful, focused, and clear. Page 151. Card number 32 in reverse, the door to spirit. When this card is reversed, you find yourself extremely disconnected, and it seems your intuition is failing. And... You can't maintain the peaceful moments you are longing for, Taurus. You may be too distracted by worldly matters or personal problems to arrive at and enjoy the deeper sense of your spiritual connection. The guidance is to relax and let go. Meditate on your soul self, your higher self that resides in your own heart center. Allow that connection to grow and you'll find that many new doors will open as a result. 
And the affirmation for this card is, I relax and connect with my spirit's wisdom and power. I live in the peace that my spirit brings. And I know that the world of spirit supports me. Card number 43 in the upright, the man holding a coin is a male connection in money, health, or value. This card shows a man sitting in a lushly flowering field holding a large bright coin. For men, this could indicate an aspect of yourself and a readiness to further your goals and receive increased health, money, or value in your life. Greater success is on its way when you take control of your own finances and act. This card could also reveal that the assistance of a financial advisor or healer whom you already know or are soon to meet. The, this man is helpful and may bring sage advice concerning the action you need to take next. Be open to this person showing up with support, but always turn to your own intuitive guidance to weigh the information you receive. This could also signify a new love interest with a wealthy man or a man from work. And the affirmation for this card is, I determine my own destiny. I take financial action and I'm receiving financial assistance from those around me. Now just don't forget, Taurus, when you get this money to pay your child support. What should he do? Now for some direction from the divine, divine feminine, divine masculine. We have Sekhmet, the red lady. I am pure strength. I honor my anger by giving voice to it. And from Jesus, we have Luke chapter 21, verse 36. Pray. Always. One more from the Divine Holy Spirit, please. For the sign of Taurus. Does Taurus need to know some? Final guidance, please, for the sign of Taurus. Lots of new things happen on the first day of school, but those little chicks handle them so well. We have the goddess of light coming through. We are all sacred mirrors reflecting back the same light. Next. And that has been your oracle reading for the sign of Taurus. Please like, share, and follow our content. And we receive donations through our PayPal that helps keep our channel going and helps me continue to bring you messages like this. Thank you so much.